So, Dad's house is now sold. Thanks to the estate agent. No, really, they actually did that thing that estate agents are supposed to do. They sold Dad's house to another person who wanted to buy it, and they paid us for it. Genius. I admit, it couldn't have been much easier for them. We're not in a chain. Selling to a first-time buyer that had the mortgage sorted, and we both had the same solicitors. Still took eight weeks. I assume it must take them a while to stick all those little pictures of houses in the front window. Must keep them busy most days. Anyway, it's sold. And hopefully the money will last long enough to pay the care home fees for a few years. And holy shit, the care home fees. They are... Fees. You think your rent is a bit crazy. Wait till they ship you out to Happy Valley Lodge because you're washing your tablets down with Swap Eager. I'm not joking. He did that, Dad. More than once. Sorted out the pair of attorney stuff as well so me and brother can control Dad's cash. That reminds me. What were the odds on the favourite of the 315 at Kempton Park? It is a bit tempting. Started clearing out the house. More an episode of Time Team with the layers of historical shit Dad has accumulated over the years. If we left it long enough, it would turn to coal under its own weight. So, top tip of the day when moving house. Do not buy lots of cardboard boxes. They break open at the most inopportune moment and are hard to carry. The solution is to get those red and blue tartan plastic market bags savoured by poor people in budget supermarkets. And that's another class indicator. The quality of your shopping bag. The current favourite being the Save the World Eco-Natural Cotton Tote Bag. And do you know how much water it takes to make cotton? Well, neither do I, but I know it's a lot. And printing inks. Not exactly eco-friendly for those third world fish or the Chinese children doing the authentic handcrafted stitching. Anyway, I go to the pound shop, which I didn't realise was a pound shop till after I'd asked the bloke behind the counter the price of a few things. I wondered why he wasn't very friendly. Oh, that's a pound as well, is it? So, I buy 20 of the tartan bags, hand over my 20 pounds, and he asks me, do I want a bag to put them in? Really? Oh, and the ceiling's done. Went for a minimalist modern art theme, all white. I called it Blank Canvas 73. Definitely Turner Prize material. Must Snapchat Alan Yentob about it later. Thank you.